Hi y'all, welcome to my channel. My name is Kwana. Hope you're having a great day. So today I'm just going to show you all these two different eye looks that you can do for Thanksgiving or honestly anytime during the fall. I love fall and all the colors, all the browns and the oranges, so this was really fun for me. Anyways, we're going to go ahead and get into the video. All right, y'all, it's super weird right now because I only have this base on. But to do this eyeshadow look, we're going to use the Warrior Palette by Juvia's Place. It's got all these nice browns, blacks, neutral shades. So, yeah, let's get started. I'm going to start off with the shade Zama, which is this bright orange shade in the center. All we're going to do is just blow it out into our crease up towards the brow bone. nice okay then on a smaller brush I'm gonna take the shade Jamata I guess that's how you say it which is like this brick red orangish color and we're gonna just pop this directly into the crease keeping it a little bit lower than the last shade that we used I'm kind of patting it first and then blending it up and then I'm gonna go back with the brush I started with not putting anything on it and just kind of Run that through again. Then I'm going to go into the shade Walzana, which is like this very dark brown. It's almost black, but like not quite. Now I'm just going to take the same brush and start patting this onto my eyelid. But I'm going to bring it just slightly above the line where my lid meets my crease. Okay, so now you see I have this kind of just patted into place on my lid. So now I'm just going to start very lightly blending upwards. Basically I'm done. Today I'm going to use the Patrick Star One Size BD eyeliner and I'm going to do a wing. You actually don't even have to do a wing. You can just tight line it but I'm going to do a wing just for the purposes of like doing something because this was so simple. So I have my little baby wing and then I'm going to go to the lower lash line and basically just do the same thing. So I'm going to use a small smudger brush. Then I'm going to tight line with the Maybelline Lasting Drama Gel Liner. Just going to put it right in the waterline. Then just going to pop on a lash. Alright, so once both ours are done, all you need to do is add some highlights. Put you some lips on and you're done. So that was three colors on our eyes. That's great. I'm going to use the same little palette I've been using to highlight, which is the Beauty Bakery Milk and Honey Palette. Um, for this one, I'm going to take this pink shade Oh Honey at the top. I'm going to take that, add some little highlights in the inner corner. And also, just add a little bit to your brow bone. And you can add highlights to the rest of your face. On the lips. I kind of want to do purple. So, I'm going to take this NYX Liquid Slade Lipstick in the shade Subversive Socialite. What a long name. It's a dark purple. I'm going to use this on the outside of my lips. Ooh, it's really dark. And then on the center, I'm going to take this lighter purple from the same brand. It's called Run the World. That looks absolutely ridiculous. Wow, my lips look huge with this on. Um, let's gloss that. Alright, I was going to put on some mascara, but I guess that's it. Okay, anyway, so you can go with a bolder lip like this one, which I'm not really feeling, so I wouldn't. Or you can go with a more neutral lip, so let's wipe this off and do a neutral lip. Okay, for the neutral lip, I'm going to take this NYX lip liner in the shade, I forgot who, Urban Cafe. I'm just going to line my lips with that. Honestly, probably just throw a gloss on top. This one's super easy. I only use three eyeshadows. And you just highlight, throw you on whatever color lip that you want. It's pretty cute. It just literally took five minutes, not even. So yeah. Anywho, that's it for this one. Um, go ahead and keep watching to see the second one. A little bit more glint. Are my new braids so cute? Okay, anyways, for our second look, this is going to be the more glam one. I'm going to use the Nubian 2 by Juvia's Place. 
I forgot I had this palette and I haven't really used it much. So yeah, still gonna be pretty simple. So my eyelids are already primed with concealer. Make sure you do that, set it with some powder. It'll help your colors to stand out a little bit more. So I'm gonna start with a big fluffy brush and I'm gonna take the shade Morocco here, which is like this burnt orange color, matches my sweater. And I'm gonna just start by buffing this into the crease. Just like that. Next, with a little bit of a smaller brush, that's a blending brush, I'm gonna go into the shade Jezebel. This is like a purple, and this is just because I wanna add some color to this one. And I'm just going to start by patting this on the outer edge of my eye, and then start blending this up into the crease, but not taking it up as high as that orange color. And then just going back with the brush I started with, not putting anything on the brush, I'm just gonna go and blend out the edges of the purple. Now, I'm gonna dip into that Warrior palette, the one that I used for the first look. And I'm just gonna take this black shade and I'm gonna bring that just a little bit lower in my crease than those two. This time I'm gonna use this little tiny smudger brush so I can keep it focused in a smaller area. Okay, so apparently my camera cut out and I didn't realize it. So at this point, the only thing that I did was cut the crease and then I added that copper shade. Okay, so I put on lashes. So I'm just gonna go ahead and blend my real lashes with the false lashes really quickly. And then I'm just gonna try to add a little bit more highlight to my eyes. So I'm going to use this Beauty Bakery Milk and Honey palette. And then taking the shade spoiler alert, I'm just gonna dust that into those little inner parts of my eye and the brow bone a little. And I already put on blush earlier, but I'm just gonna do it for the purposes of showing y'all. I'm gonna use this Afrique Bella Brush <laughs> blush. Um, this is from Genius Place. It's like an orangish, orangish color. I'm gonna line my lips with just a brown liner. And then I'm going to fill in with this NYX Liquid Suede Lipstick in the shade Club Hopper. It's kind of like a purplish color. That looks kind of brown too. Um, I want my nose to be contoured just a little bit harder, so... I'm really just wasting for I'm just wasting footage right now. I'm gonna have to edit later. All right, y'all. I'm done. That was so easy. We used like three colors and it looks beautiful. It matches my sweater. Anyways, thanks y'all for watching this video. I really hope that you and your family or you and whoever you're spending this holiday season with is great and safe. Don't spread the COVID because you don't, you don't want none of that. Anyways, happy holidays. Love you guys. Thanks for watching. Bye.